What's going on guys? Not Rainbow here with another reaction video. And I'm going to be checking out the uh, Ultra Fast Pony series. Um, starting with season one. Uh, this is by Ricarb. Uh, pretty short videos here. So what, because of that, what I'm going to do is I'm going to do multiple videos uh, at once. Uh, probably five at a time. Considering there's a lot of these, so hopefully this will help me uh, get through this a lot faster. Um, no clue what this is. Um, I'm assuming it's like a little mini abridged series, but yeah, not really going to uh, just have to watch it to find out. So go ahead and get started in 3, 2, 1, start. Ultra Fast Pony. Meanwhile. In Equestria. Aw, yeah. <laughs> According to this book I'm reading, the world is going to end soon. I think that might be bad. Really? Well, what gives you the idea? Such a good thing I was reading that book. Imagine if I was reading any other book in the world. Oh, yeah. Such a good thing I just happened decided to read that book. <laughs> so important. Spike! Da? Da? Tell Celestia I can't make the tea party. I'm going to Ponyville to save the world. And everyone will love me. It shall be so. We need to prepare. Why it is he German? It ugly down there. Did a book called The Elements of Harmony show up in the mail yet? The book that holds the key to our success? The one thing that is needed to prevent <laughs> the entire destruction of the world? Yep. I am so sorry about your book, my master. That isn't good enough, Spike. <laughs> Why is everything always your fault? Uh, I am a failure. Pony, <laughs> go to the library and prepare my coming. I Quality of the... Hell yeah. Oh, yeah, bro. This fox uh, smells like pony dude? droppings. Uh, well, it just smells like brush when I bury you under it. What? No, nothing. We're just, a, we're just a normal family. No need to get along. involved. We sell apples. We sell apples. <laughs> is this your harem? <laughs> Oh no, today we're celebrating Apple Bloom's initiation into the family. I got it up a pig! That there pony is our leader, Granny Smith. And over there is Big Mac. Yarrr! He thinks he's a pirate. And I've seen him break a pony in half, so I'm not about to tell him otherwise. Are uh -huh. you the, the mob? Yeah. Why don't you have an apple twilight? <laughs> and don't even think about telling the law. I will cut your nuts off. Like, get out of my way. Damn it. I, like, totally ruined your hair, and I'm not even going to apologize. Truly, you oh, God, is, is that evil evil the evils in all of Equestria. Diamond Tiara, Rainbow like, Dash. Oh, MC, I totally hate you, but, like, secretly, I don't. But really, I hate you. Oh, my God. Later, loser. <laughs> <laughs> Spike, we have a new mission. I'm going to take that pony down. But what about the ends of the world? Oh, you bet I'm going to end her world. You there, Simpleton. Tell me about wow. the pony whose name is probably Rainbow Dad. I require her deepest secrets so that I can rue her day. That doesn't even... What? <laughs> oh, mate, you look like roadkill. Screw you, I'm fabulous. Fashion montage. Do you have anything good for stealth missions? Mate, I got just the thing. Check this out. Is, is that supposed to be Australian? Gimp suit? It might be. Oh, God. D do you like it? I'll take that as a no. I'm going to need a Pegasus if I want revenge. <laughs> you there, tell me everything you know about Rainbow Dash. Rainbow Dash is my friend. Damn it. You can call me Fluttershy, because I'm so shy. Oh, You're what? annoying. Snoop Dogg. <laughs> Get out. Now what is the all stereotypes. this? Stereotypes. It's me, Brew. Remember, Brew? You said you wanted that feast, so I made one. He's gonna be better than Celestia's 111th birthday, I tell you, dear. Going to bed. Master, weren't we supposed to be doing something very important? What is this? <laughs> no. Hello, every pony, and welcome to the festivities of my native people. I thank you all for coming <laughs> and for not running against me as mayor again, especially after oh my last opportunity was dead in that river. We may never know how he got there. <laughs> you suck! Yes, well, you're a cow. <laughs> No, wait. <laughs> no, 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 no. What is that? Sad. Damn it, I knew I forgot something. <laughs> Why didn't Spike remind me? I will ruin you all. Oh, no. It's so wrong. Like, oh, MC, stop grabbing my tail. I hate that. Sad. 
I can't Sad. believe it. After a thousand years. Night Moon Mare. One Night evil Moon Mare. Villain. I will rend your bones from your flesh. Well, think she's evil. She's evil, right, bro? Oh, yeah, she am sure. Sand. Stop saying sand. Balls to you, I'll say what I want. Wait, I, could kill I thought you she was saying sand. Why is she saying sand? Away. Don't worry, I have a plan. Damn it! <laughs> <laughs> What is this? Oh my god. <laughs> oh dear god. Okay. Yeah, so that <laughs> I I don't I don't even know. What the fuck? <laughs> uh, I I can't even wrap my head around this. That was so weird. <laughs> and so many stereotypes. What the fuck? Okay. I, I, I'm just going to pull up the next episode. Oh, dear God. Okay. Start this one in three, two, one. Start. Sad. We were in the last episode. Once upon a time, the land of Equestria was ruled over by two princesses. One ruled the day and one ruled the night. All the ponies loved the white princess of the day, but they were scared of the evil black princess and her foreign ways. So the good uh -huh. white princess banished the evil princess to the moon to work the lunar cotton fields for a thousand years. But the wow. evil black princess used her wicked black magic to escape, and we have to yeah. stop her. And those are all the plot holes we missed from the first episode. And are we getting this for us? Where the bloody hell did Spike go? I don't even know any of your names. Damn it! <laughs> Fine, we're in the forest to find Nightmare Moon, and Spike, Spike's asleep. So what you're telling me is that there's a giant evil princess trying to take over the world, and Spike's asleep. Um, yeah. Yes. Whoever wrote this episode must have had brain damage or something, eh, bro? It doesn't matter. Just everyone follow me. And like, why are you the leader? Because unlike the rest of you bozos, I actually know what's going on. So unless you know any other purple-eyed students with fabulous hair and have no prior experience but are somehow completely capable of taking on a larger and quite clearly stronger force of evil with only the help of a few friends who also have no experience in supernatural or military power, <laughs> then I suggest you all shut up and do exactly as I say. Was that a Star Wars reference? Damn it! Oh my <laughs> Help! I'm too amazing to die! Who you got your rarity? And wait a minute. You're not rarity. You're that new pony everyone hates, but everyone wow. loves me. Yeah, I say so the bad. Is I hate you. Off you go. <laughs> ah, I saved your life, and like I did too. Uh, wait a minute, you're not Fluttershy. Oh, I'm God. Fluttershy. I'm Twilight Sparkle. Duh. Oh, Binky Boy. Name's Rarity. No, him Applejack. And now you know their names. <laughs> <laughs> Kill the endangered species. Jalapel. What? Don't you ever, ever say that again. Well, at least I have a new friend. I could have friends if I want to. Oh. I just don't want to. <laughs> hey, he's up. I got this. Croc Hunter! <laughs> Careful, Rudy. I think you cut yourself. Wow. Oh, she's right, mate. I'm always cutting myself. Uh -huh. You know, I'm, I'm, when I'm sewing. Sewing dresses, some, sometimes I accidentally hurt myself. Mm-hmm. What are you all looking at? Are we there yet? No, we're not there. Oh, look, guys, we're here. It's just a coincidence. We're not really here. Really? I'm pretty sure we're here, mate. <laughs> magical doohickeys work. They rely on friendship, but they only work with magic. Well, that's a terrible lesson for the children. How are we supposed to tell them, no matter how big your problem is, you can only solve it with magic? That is exactly right. Like this. Like, is she gone? No. Ah, oh, Twilight. Welcome to my humble abode. Oh, not you again. <laughs> Don't you even think about saying it. I swear, if you say it one more time, I will kill you. Sam. <laughs> oh, it is on. I will murder everyone you love. I hope you get crabs. Well, that's wow. kind of a mean thing to say. Yeah, really. And the crabs give you cancer. 
What? Crabancer. Uh-huh. I don't know what to say. <laughs> For the superior species. How about you? Sorry, we're late, eh? Vaguely established magical friend powers activate. Uh -huh. What the heck is that? It's a rainbow. It's a block hole. <laughs> Deal with it. Sad. I really hope she's dead. Sad. Damn it. <laughs> so there I was having a nice tea party all by myself, I might add, when it turns out that my sister has escaped from the moon. We should have a party, eh? No, no, we should not do that. And you, my sister, are in a lot of trouble. Balls. Balls. Oh, no, tell me you're still going on with that catchphrase. Stab you in the neck. Uh, oh, I missed. <laughs> Does this mean I can go home and get away from these stupid ponies? You know what, Twilight? You ditched me at my tea party. You can't come home. You're stuck here forever. Damn. Have fun with your new friends. You guys know I was kidding about that stupid pony thing, right? I don't really like you very much. <laughs> oh my god. Who's that Pokemon? <laughs> it's Mewtwo. No. It's Clefairy. Clefairy. Well, I'll get it next time. Yeah, I, I don't even know what Pokemon that was anyway, so... <laughs> Didn't watch the show. Oh my god. <laughs> I I'm I'm probably just gonna have to wait till I watch all these these other three episodes before I say anything. My I just I don't even know right now. <laughs> okay. Let me just get it. Episode three pulled up. Started in three, two, one. Start. Ultra fast pony. You know, it's not even really that fast. Oh, quit your whining. You still have a lot of work to do to pay off the debt you owe us. I keep telling you it wasn't my fault. I didn't know you didn't want most of your family teleported to the nether dimension. Wow. I don't think I've ever seen Apple Flitter cry that much. What in the name of potatoes was that? <laughs> oh my goodness, Spike. Was that a sound effect? I think the quality of this show is moving up a bit. It seems like it. We'll be getting background music before you know it. And the sound Not bloody quality likely. has increased too. I think this is the best lip syncing I've ever seen. <laughs> I agree. <laughs> yeah. Great lip syncing. Okay. Message from Princess Celestia, Master. Twilight Sparkle. Since Luna has graced us with her presence, she has the goal to actually want her own room to live in. So I need you and some other pony to come help me move my stuff out of the second basement on the right down the lower hallway. Wow. I can't pay you. Use these tickets to gain entry. Also, they double as entries to the Grand Galloping Gala. But that won't mean anything for a long time. <laughs> Twilight, you have to give me that other ticket. Why do you want to go? I got business ventures I need to sort out in Candlelot. What kind of All right, business? Scotty. The none of your damn business kind of business. Like Power to engines. Way, Twilight, you totally War Factor 5. How the hell are you weak? I gave Did you make enough geek jokes there. Elephant for 10 days. Oh, I don't know. I got like bored. Why do you want to come? <laughs> I want to like steal some of her stuff. It's going to be like the best opportunity ever. You both make good points. You better give me the ticket or I'll have a big Macintosh break while with your legs. Applejack makes both a good legs. point. Give it to me or I'll like <laughs> hang around. Yeah, she has like four legs. Day. Tell you what, give me some time to think about it. Are you sure it's wise to go into the town, Master? What's the worst that could happen? Suddenly, no wait, sound effects. Beauty! Oh, don't tell me you two want to go as well. Dude, Peter Jackson's gonna be there. I want to show him my fan fiction. Oh, oh no, God, baby. no! You gotta let me go. <clears throat> it's where I'll meet him. I really don't want to know what you're talking about. It's where the prince will be. He'll whisk me away in his strong, beefy arms, and we'll get married right there on the floor. Really? Well, that's just really horrifying. Yeah. And then on our honeymoon night, he'll carry me into the bedchambers and gently lay me down, whispering sweet, soggy nothings in my ear. After that, he'll tie me to the bed and pull out his... Damn it! <laughs> what is wrong with you? Oh my god. I was gonna say branding iron, 
so many what? damn mental images. <laughs> you wanna go to the Grand Gap Because uh, I'm just so shy. Yes, really? we're shy, we get it. You're the shy one. I'm so shy. He's pretty sure I can tell. I think she's really shy. You gotta let me go to the gala. We're going there to help Celestia move her stuff, remember? I forgot, because I'm so shy. <laughs> it's getting really old really quick. I hope all of my episodes revolve around me being shy. Oh, uh, I will. <laughs> I just can't choose who I want to take with me, but probably not Fluttershy, but I just can't Aww. choose. Why, like, oh, no. like, it's me? Give me the ticket or I'll rain on you. Give me the ticket and I'll let you join in. Damn it, Twilight, you forgot to help me sell all this junk. Give me the ticket or I'll add it to your debt. Give me the ticket or I'll stay in your house. Oh, no. Being shy. If I threw you really oy, would you give me the ticket E? Sweet mother of Celestia, will you all shut up? I can't think, I can't decide, so now no, none of you get to go. I hope you're happy. Spike, send the tickets back to Princess Celestia. I don't think that's a good idea, Master. Remember what she said. Just do it, Spike! <laughs> <sighs> the heck? It would appear that I didn't make myself clear. You are coming to help me move. And now, since you have taken your sweet, sweet time, all of you are coming to help me. <laughs> Yay, now we all get to go together like a family. You know, no. I never had a family. Just thought I'd let you know. Luckily, I don't have to go to that stupid moving. Oh, God. Spike, I'm so lonely. Be my friend. I'm going to sell <laughs> this ticket at exorbitant prices. No, that's the upper way of thinking. It's been one week since you looked at me. Cocked your head to the side and I'm angry. Five days since you laughed at me. Saying, get back together, come back and see me. Spike, do it again. Okay. That is the best thing ever. <laughs> oh, God, I haven't heard that song in a long time. Oh, my God. <laughs> Uh, this, this is definitely a thing. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Alright, start episode 4 in 3, 2, 1, start. Hold your fast pony. Yar, that be a lot of babble. And they're all ours. Why are you We've got this pirate? Our ooze now. We'll have these moved by tomorrow morning. But you get back to training, and don't forget he goes down in the fourth, so don't knock him out early this time. Yar. <laughs> uh -oh. Run, every pony! It's dirty, illegal immigrants. <laughs> oh God! <laughs> Oi, this is my town. Get your own. You may have won this time, Applejack, but we bovines will return. Try it and die, bovine <laughs> boys. Move out. The bugger me, that's a lot of cows. Ah, oh, bollocks! <laughs> I just remembered Big Mac's not here. Maybe some of the ponies in town could help me fight. And that's why we're giving this award to Snuggleberry for being a cutesy wootsy cuddle pie. Uh -huh. I like showing up to my birthday party when no one else did. Kanye West! Wait a minute, let me see that. Dear God. For being a cutie wootsy. Ah, oh, damn, I'm going to die. What's the problem, Applejack? <laughs> we need to collect all these apples if I'm to use them as weaponry tomorrow. Why doesn't Big Mac help you? He's got a big fight he's training for, and no one ever interrupts his training. So you're gathering all these apples? Of course I am. Why wouldn't I be? Well, I was just thinking maybe you shouldn't collect all these apples. Give me one good reason why I shouldn't punch you in the face. Well, shouldn't you have more effective weapons of war? Also, why do you need weapons? Oh, that reminds me. The catapult. So like, the you catapult. just want me to stand here? Yes, that's right. You stand there. And I launch out the cows. Like, yeah, I haven't been this happy since Snuggleberry came to my birthday party that you didn't come to. You would have seen her there. Or no one else there. Oh, <laughs> shut up. Here I yes, come. Yes, Wait, I don't want to do this anymore. No! <laughs> Try to deal as much damage as you can. Ow, that hurt. Noise draw, you bulljack. But you will not stop us with your measly catapult. Hey, you're new. Be my friend or I'll hate you. Get down of here. <laughs> party pooper. Okay, so that didn't work. Oh, you know, hey, my friend, I hate you. You're the expert on cruel and unusual warfare. What do you got for me? 
Oh, brew muffins. 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 Her ah, balls to you, I'll try Fluttershy. <laughs> How about Stampy the cute little bunnies? That's a terrible idea. Let's see yeah, what they got. They were so the terrified. Apple warfare it is. Hi, Applejack, it's me, Twilight. I swear to God, do we even have to in a question? I don't know. <laughs> what do you want, Twilight? I was just wondering if you're still collecting those apples. No. There is no reason for me not to be collecting these apples, Twilight. Look, just please don't collect them. Like I'm gonna listen to you. Damn. Applejack, you have to stop. What do you mean? What are you talking about? Get off me. Applejack, there's something I've been meaning to tell you, but I just don't know how. Background music? Twilight. Applejack, I, I accidentally poisoned all your apples. I'm sorry. You what? did what? It was for an experiment, and it, I needed it, it went well. Things went bad. Twilight, you daft ninny! What am I going to do with all these poisoned? Poison, you say? Um, <laughs> and how good would you say this poison is then? I don't know. I haven't tested it yet. I see. Today, as good friends, I decided to give you all a treat, cause we're all good friends here. Try some of this apple po juice I got for you. Wow. Like, that was so good. This is so much better than my birthday party. Pinky, is everything all right? Oh, no. I'm feeling something. Oh, yes. We'll be having steak for dinner tonight. What's the matter, Cornel C? Dear God, no. Snuggle Bear was like... My best friend, and now she's died. She got run over by bunnies. Freaking bunnies! <laughs> she's not fair. I know I hate everyone, but why does everyone hate me? I can't imagine why, Rainbow Dash. <laughs> okay. Let me pull up episode 5, start in 3, 2, 1, start. Ultra fast, Barry. Because you know, Twilight, when they all go into the mines of Moria, they leave Bill behind. So in uh -huh. my story, they obviously need another pony. That's where the brave and sexy Pinky comes in. All this time, she's been living with Galadriel and all the other elves in Hey, Pinky, I just had a great idea. Go annoy someone else. Oh, yeah, Kibru. Rebu, want to hear the rest oh, of the story? I'll skip ahead a bit. <laughs> so Frodo, Sam, hear and it. Pinky, who will I'm be playing by me, and just split up the rest of the fellowship. Story. But then all I'm of a sudden, and here's story. the big twist. No, no, Bill comes back, blah, blah, blah. and he's looking all bumping and handsome, story. and we instantly fall in love. But so Frodo wanna, gives the one ring to Bill, and he goes down on his knees with a heart pack and all surprise. But deep down, I knew I'd been waiting for this a long time. And that's when the meteor strikes. The meteor? What kind of Lord of Rings fanfic are you reading? Oh Peggy, dear God, I've no! I'm thinking, you're annoying, and I'm annoying. Hasn't it been racist enough? Annoy everyone. Yuki. <laughs> that was the best thing ever. That sounded like Peter Griffin. Bored now. No target. Oh, please let there be deadly thorns in here. Oh, no. My allergies. Lol. <laughs> it's not funny, guys. Make She's it stop. Stuck Make it stop. Loop. Oh, this is the best treadmill ever. Bro, bro, wow. Look at it go, bro. She's stuck. One, two, three, four. Yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. No, Pinky. Being with you has been so fun. I've never had any friends. And you're like the best friend to me now. Oh, boo. I painted your eye. I didn't do that, Pinky. It's not funny. <laughs> it's not funny, Pinky. Why would you do that? Oh, she'll be fine. She'll get over it. Rainbow, <laughs> no, she won't. You want to see my cosplay? The cosplay. Wait, Pinky. You've been friend dumbed. This is my new friend, Gala. I just found her. Nice, eh? Nice to meet you, old bean. Bloody poms. You know, I've never had a friend before. 
Usually everyone is off put by my ugly appearance and crooked teeth. Uh, yeah, you're pretty what? ugly. But I don't have any other friends, so you'll have to do. Badly good of you, I must say. Where have you gone mid? You can't be friends with a non pony. Well, we haven't really had the chance to be friends yet. And I was wondering, since you and Rainbow Dash always hang out together, and I've never been able to, could you possibly just let me have this one day to spend with my new friend? It would be awfully nice of you. And she's not even hanging out with another pony. <laughs> ah, this must be the episode we delve into racism. No, that's not for a little bit yet. That's well, not I really racist. hate Gilda. Do the opposite of what she says. And get out of my house. Oh, I'm gonna spoil you so hard. Oh, sorry, old bean. We seem to have bumped into each other. It's the slave driver coming back to get me. Oh, I woke up what? into the fields. Mount Luther King. <laughs> oh, yeah, that didn't go well. Perhaps a cup of tea would help her. I can't believe oh, I just saw Gilda assault and savage flourish joy. Well, this justifies everything I'm gonna do. Welcome to death, Gilda. <laughs> I mean the party. A party that's to die for. I say, this is the best birthday I've ever had. Burn the evil one. Well, new we, how are you still alive? <laughs> that was pretty good, Panko. <laughs> well, I do enjoy a good friend, but I did have a pacemaker installed just yesterday. And I do also have my diabetes, so I was just wondering. Oh, yeah, bro, I heard all about your diabetes. Don't worry, try some of these, they're good for you. Well, you are a very good friend, I suppose I can trust you. Oh dear, I'm not feeling very well. Like, wash it down with that tea. Ah, tea, so good to have you back. Oh, I do believe the burning hot tea has landed on my feet. Quite... Qu qu quite painful. Bloody griffins just don't die, eh? <laughs> I'm quite sorry that I'll have to leave the party, everyone, but I am going to have to go to the hospital as I am in rather gratuitous amounts of pain. Uh, you know what, Gilda? Don't bother coming back. You're boring me now. Oh, and that's another friend I've lost. Well, at least I'll always have football. It's called soccer, right. you nonce. Get out of here. Well, I'll just be on my way then. And that's why we call this place Ponyville. Because of the racism? Damn right. <laughs> Pony power forever. Our house in the middle of our street. Our house in the middle of our street. Our house in the middle of our street. I'm just writing a letter. Oh, what is this? Invisible ink? Is this what we're teaching our children now? Yes, yep. no, I see why they say this has great morals for all the children. No, that's really great. I mean, what kind of idiotic writers tells children that it's okay to be continuously playing pranks on everyone? Really? We're raising a generation of assholes. That's what we're doing. <laughs> so true. Oh my goodness. Um, that was very unexpected. <laughs> Oh man, I'm glad these episodes are really short because I don't know how much of that I could have taken. <laughs> like it, it was funny. Don't get me wrong. I like I, said, I just didn't expect that. <laughs> I didn't think it was there's gonna be all those stereotypes in there. Oh good lord! And the Rainbow Dash voice is gonna annoy the hell out of me. Hell, even Flourish I was annoyed the hell out of me. Oh my goodness. This is going to be very interesting to watch. <laughs> oh, man. It is interesting, though. Didn't have any sound effects in the uh, 4 or 5, I don't think. I don't think I heard any sound effects. There might have been. No way. Episode 4, four did have one when she bumped her head into the tree. Still no background music though, as of yet. Well, there was one in episode 4, they started playing one and they kind of ditched it. <laughs> but... Yeah... <laughs> uh, I'm still trying to wrap my brain around what I just saw. Uh, that was very interesting. Put it nicely. <laughs> okay, I'll, I'll check out the next five uh, at another time. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Take it easy.